how to select the right level sensor. To choose the best level sensor, we need know the nature and state of the media, but also the pros and limitations of different detection methods. Below are currently the most common liquid level monitoring technologies. Hydrostatic. This is to use the level sensor installed at the bottom to detect the liquid pressure at the bottom, and convert and calculate the liquid level height. It is suitable for almost all media, and features easy installation, wide popularity, and low cost. But the measurement is affected by the density and temperature of the medium, and calibration is required during the conversion. Capacitive. Different media have different dielectric constants, capacitive sensors measure specific values as the liquid level of the medium increases or decreases by sensing changes of capacitance in the container. They are capable of various chemical liquids, highly viscous substances, food, pharmaceutical liquids. They feature high accuracy, good stability and reliability, provided that the medium needs to be calibrated. Ultrasonic. It works by the time of flight principle, using the speed of sound. This is a precise, non-contact method with the advantages of easy installation, high flexibility, not affected by the material to be tested. However, ultrasonic sensors do not work fine in containers with foam, steam, dust, vacuum and geometric shapes. Also, some space should be left at the tank top, so the tank cannot be full. Radar. Its working principle is a function of TDR. The accuracy and stability are good. In addition, it is easy to install and calibrate, with good flexibility. It can be used to measure applications with foam, dust, and even stirring, while the dielectric constant of the medium needs to be considered, and there are requirements on installation, position, and flange height. Like ultrasonic sensors, radar level gauges have also blind spots. We also need know the specific working conditions and the measured medium, including measuring range, temperature, pressure range, and the medium characteristics, such as the medium state, chemical aggressiveness, viscosity, whether it contains impurities, whether hygiene certification is required. Then, we need make a final evaluation, including product budget, installation, and debugging and use environment, and so on. Contact us for more.